Hey guys, what is going on? It is Mitch here, and today I am going to be bringing you guys another top five, and in this one, this is going to be the top five best details in zombies. And so, guys, what this is, like, guys, are probably like, what the crap is this? What this is is this can be small things, just like something they added in the map two huge things as easter eggs but like you know i'm not gonna give any uh, not gonna give anything away but anyways guys that is the back cat ground to this and yeah so guys coming in at our number five spot we have the different types of zombies so like there are like what i mean by this is the costume so like we have the not uh, the Kino Dertoten zombies, the Buried zombies, the Origin zombies, the Mob of the Dead zombies, the Die Rise zombies, they all look different. And I think that that alone is really cool. And like that is just a detail that I like personally. And by the way, I'm going to add these can be interactive objects. So yeah, uh, coming in at our number four spot, this is going to be the uh, perks. Um, so, this is, this sounds really dumb, but I love how they set up the perks, how the machines look and stuff, because you have, like, you could, they could have done something like the box, where, like, you get all the perks, and, like, you can, like, scroll through or whatever, but they gave each perk an individual song, an individual machine, and I think it looks, personally, just, it looks really cool. Uh, like this one was kind of just I didn't really have anything it could have been at number five But that is that and yeah anyways guys that brings us down to the number three spot And this is going to be the origins robots So I know what you guys are thinking why but if you think about it interactive objects So this goes under that I think it adds a lot to origins It makes it like better and it will like as you can see in this gameplay I went up into the robots head it like you can do that you get the thunder staff parts it has something else to do with the easter egg you can use it to hoard like i went before i went up there i was gonna get trapped and i shot into the foot and the zombies got wrecked uh, anyways guys that brings us down to our number two spot and in this one this is going to be the mob of the dead dogs and i think these guys look amazing amazeballs guys so like you have the three zom uh, the three dogs the one uh, on the by the spawn the one by the plane and then the one over on the docks and then when you feed all of them up and they all go back into their wall hole thing content you go uh, from the docks like you guys know probably go like up into the place where the boxes like can be and you go and you just see that tomahawk just floating there floating there it looks really cool pick it up you get that nice spinning animation to it then you can just wreck the zombies like i'll put in some like just gameplay of me doing that obviously uh, yeah that is all for number two and guys coming down to our number one spot this is going to be the bosses so uh this was a really nice detail all the way from the kino gertrude gameplay i have is really laggy but as you see the dogs look amazing to some i won't have gameplay for but the denizens those are just annoying the avogadro and like anything that wasn't really a zombie like the nova crawlers the the magma lava zombie whatever from um what map was that oh my shangri-la the wind zombie from there the panzer i like the, that guy he's amazing he's hard to take down he makes you like oh crap round eight panzer round i have to have something to take him down with brutus same with him only he's a bit like he has more to do with the easter egg than the panzer does I guess, um, what else is there, um, okay, the, uh, jumping jacks, I thought were just annoying, but, like, they're just, bosses made the game so much better, like, imagine playing Origins with no Panzer, like, you just be running around with the zombies, it'd be way too easy, so the Panzer, I feel, and Brutus, they all add something to the game, 
But yeah, guys, anyways, this took a lot of time because I had to get all the game plan. I've been really busy. So if you guys did enjoy this, please make sure to go down, like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. And as always, my voice is giving out. That's not always, but it's happening. Uh, and as, a, uh, as always, guys, I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye, mates.